I want to talk to white people. If y'all really want things to be equal and fair across the board, stop always controlling the narrative to what you would like other people to be and look and feel. Because, you know, I get tired of even some of us as black people, we undermine each other. Like, how you how we supposed to have Black Lives Matter and we undermine each other? We call each other ugly. We say nappy hair. We find something wrong with each other. We get we give every we make everybody else feel comfortable of the middle. Well, women, I'm gonna say the middle for y'all. Next bill for y'all, but black people, you know, white people, stop always controlling the marriage to your favoritism. Stop always making it where y'all want people to feel down and people feel about and, and y'all feel good about yourself. Because no offense, even to some of y'all white people that want to have people to look like y'all want everybody, y'all want certain males to have a certain look and certain females to have a look. But at the same time, y'all want to y'all want to um, be the one to think. Y'all want to be the one to make it like this is your t- this is my type. This should be your type. Excuse me. And another thing I want to talk about males. It don't let stop letting other males tell y'all what should give you a boner and what shouldn't. That's your business. As long as you're not looking at kids and raping and messing nobody, don't let any other male tell y'all what should give y'all a boner. Because even some men want to tell me what I should like and not like. Excuse me. Whether I'm your type or not, it's none your business. It's just like what you like is none my business. And that's another thing. But white people, stop controlling the narrative to your favor. And no, I'm not going pro whack. I'm not doing no pro whack. But I'm just saying because I'm tired of some white people. Y'all want to always control America of how y'all want someone to look, think, and feel. And y'all don't give other people room, but y'all want to say equality. How come y'all as a white man, y'all get to look the way y'all want, but y'all want someone to look like this? How come people in my community, we can't have, we can't have, we can't have space to have emotional safety and physical safety? And stop always making it where you want to be safe. Stop making it where you always want to be the smart one. You always want to be the one to have this sense because that's hurtful. Nobody's put here to be your object, white men and white women. Nobody's put here just to be someone to mock your kitchen. No one's just be here to put here just to cook. No one's to put here just to see how big they are in the big or what their sex is. We are more than what y'all want to control the merit of. And we're tired of that. We are. I'm tired of y'all always one minute saying black people don't stay together. There's a reason why we don't stick together because we easily prey on easy targets and some of y'all want to control the marriage for other people to fill against each other. But y'all want to talk about that. And y'all want to talk about why people are saying, like I never forgot one time I went to this one party and it was underage people there and people going like, get on me. But I was already illegal. See what I mean? I'm tired of people like me always got to be put on a fucking unfair, un- unrealistic pedestal, but I can't be seen as a human. And black people, can we stop saying all this magical, this, where that, that? No, we're humans, too. I don't want to be put on no pedestal. And I definitely don't want to be put below an insect. I want to be put as, a, I want to be in the middle archy where I could be safe, have fun, and not be on some eggshells. Because I'm tired of most of my life, I'm supposed to be scared of what somebody's going to say and do to me. I'm tired of that. I want to feel not only physically safe, I want to feel emotionally safe. Not like, oh my God, I'm scared. Oh my God, is somebody going to do this and that? See, white people, if y'all really, and whether y'all liberal or Republican, I could give it in because I'm not on it. If y'all really, really, really love us, let us have our own merit. Let us be individuals. Let us have emotional safety and physical safety. And let us not settle for less. But not let us be too much on the top. I mean, I can't speak for everybody, but speaking for me, All I want is a fair balance. That's all I want is a fair middle. All I want is a fair, comfortable area, not just physically, but psychologically, emotionally. I want to not be always, oh, you're not doing this. You're not doing that. I don't mind people judging me, but all I ask is for a fair, fair middle. Not always be scared to ask. Not always get judged and rate on how I look. Because one minute y'all say, oh, Y'all conceded your main, but then you judge somebody. Look, see, some of y'all start this of making people feel too skinny, making people feel too fat, making people feel too tall, too short, not enough, too light, too dark. No, it's got to be a balance. With y'all controlling the merit to where y'all get to have high, low, and middle, and then black people, we got to have this dream of worse or better. It's got to be a middle for everybody. But I'm asking y'all, stop always controlling the merit. Stop. Please give everybody room. Give everybody, don't act like, don't act like you think you know us. That's nice that y'all read up on things, but there's more to life than just read up on what you think you know. Like I said, you know, me, I never, as a child, the reason why I never liked to read, because 
stuff couldn't reach me in there. Oh, no, you got to use these words. Oh, no, you got to think this way, like this. Like, for example, I, I have an extra degree level. I'm not afraid to admit that. But, and also, black people, stop also looking down at other black people that can't speak right, but you lust at them. See, I got another bill for y'all. Ladies, I'm going to make y'all the next video. I'm going to make y'all the bill after the next video. But, um, white people, I just need you to stop always controlling America. Stop acting like you think you know people. Give people room. Meet people where they at and learn from them there. But stop controlling the narrative, please. Stop acting like you think you know people. You don't. You don't you're not no x-ray bonnet man or violent woman. You're a person. Just like we don't try to act like, oh, I think I know you. Even with the special I have of y'all, I didn't act all like, oh, I think I know y'all. Oh no, I don't know y'all. Y'all don't know me. Give things a chance in a fair way balance. That's all I'm saying. You know, I don't want to be told what I want to hear and then be fucked over. But I don't want to be put down and shot down. I want to survive emotionally, mentally, and physically. That's what I like to do. All right. But I just have to say, stop always making a merit of weird what you are like and, and why other people feel miserable and insecure. Like even on my, that's why I go hard on my bill like I do of all different shapes by type because even, that's why I'm glad y'all stop saying gay is new black. Gay is not the new black. Y'all know y'all look at a person's race and color before you look at everything else. What? Because everybody have a terrible motive of why they're attracted to people. But give everybody room. Don't be sitting here saying, oh yeah, I love black people because I date some black people. Don't be saying you love black people because you go to soul food. Just be the hell who you are. Don't fake with nobody. Be yourself, white people. Don't even put on that slang mango. I mean, it's up to y'all if y'all want to talk slang, but stop making it where you want to have the always the upper hand. Give people a fair, a fair balance. Give it. All right. I love y'all.